first tour with uh with uh, Raheem Devon and, and Leela James, I really got to see um how effective my single was, how effective what what his love was. I really got to see the power of TV and how it, it really like you know, touches people and stuff like that. Um, I remember this one girl, she, um, I think I was in New Orleans, if I'm not mistaken. And she had been following me for a long time. And I, I hadn't known, I didn't know it. Uh, but my manager told me, you know, one of your um, super supporters is here and she really wants to meet you and stuff like this. So I met her backstage and she just told me this, story of how she was really on the verge of just you know taking herself out because she had been bullied for so long and she just you know she just suffering through depression and just didn't know how to deal you know what i mean and i spoke with her and her mom and uh you know she just started crying and just telling me how much of a you know impact um I had on her when she found out about me and she started following me. And uh, that really, really touched me because I feel like that's what my whole mission is all about. It's, it's touching the hearts and souls of, of, of the people. You know, you know, what if that girl never got wind of me? What if she, she, she followed through with you know, taking herself out. But something, you know, in, in my song, something about, you know, what she saw, she saw herself in me. I mirrored her and uh, she's here today. So for me, <laughs> that's, 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 that's all the, the, the <laughs> validation I need uh, as far as what, 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 what I'm here to do. So that was the most probably impactful situation or impactful moment that I had um, on tour is knowing that people, you never know who's watching you. You never know what who you're influencing or what lives you could be changing, where re realities you could be changing through your art. Like, it's really real. <laughs> the power of this phone and that TV, it's very, very real. And and we got we have to be responsible when we have, uh, when we get to, you know, have our platforms like this. I'm pushing this thing go juicy. I really want people like to enjoy that when they, you know, on your downtime to <laughs> create the balance of this whole pandemic and all of this, all of these injustices that are happening. Please enjoy that. You can also go to my YouTube and, um, you know, look on my page and subscribe and see all the other things that I've been doing. And, uh, just look out for a lot of new stuff. My project will be hitting the streets before summer is over. I'm not going to give it a specific date yet because I don't want to put my foot in my mouth. <laughs> but trust me, it's going to be amazing. And in the meantime, everybody just work on themselves. Be diligent about learning and acquiring as much knowledge as you can during this time. Take care of each other. You know, see how your neighbor is doing. See if they need anything. Check on the elderly. You know what I mean. Just be present because we're what a time, what a time we living in. You know what I'm saying. So uh, that's all I wanted to say. And in, in the meantime, you can check me out on my platform, Instagram, B Bozeman, um, Twitter, B Bozeman Music. I'm there for any, you know, future uh, dates or you know announcements. It'll be all on my platforms. <laughs>